All right, we've been putting a little bit of work in on the car. Got the rear suspension hooked up. The reinforcements are done. The rear uh, bushings are all in. We made the shift linkage to the proper length. Um, feels really nice. The transmission has fifth gear lean, but I think that'll be okay. I'm not worried about it. Um, cut some holes in the trunk for the secondary reservoirs for the shocks. And overall, just making a little bit of progress this weekend. Check it out. Got the BCs installed. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Rear caliper brackets are installed. Oh, that's these. <laughs> Got that all in there. I'll show you that. I've got another video where I make brackets for a Mustang. Check that out if you're interested in making rear caliper brackets, uh, dual rear caliper brackets. Got the bushings and all that installed. The reinforcements are done. I just had white spray paint, so you can check, you can see that pretty easily. Front and back are done. You can see it down in there. Cut some holes in the trunk to pass the reservoirs through, which are mounted in there. Nice, nice. And uh, R, you know, R stands for really far left, and uh, L stands for legitimately the right side. I think what we're going to probably work on next will either be the passenger seat bracket and sliders or maybe our homemade E36 uh, cut knuckles and extended arms. We're going to play around with this, try to get something set up. But yeah, we're getting there. It'll be done one day. Justin's favorite pastime. Ah, <laughs> uh, shit. What's up, buddy? So, we're gonna do... Uh, we're currently... Tom, well, Tommy's filming. 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 Uh, we're doing E46 arms and... No! And extended, Wrong! Extended E36 arms, I mean. Yep. We're gonna extend, extend arms E36 and arms and, and cut the knuckles. Yeah. Do, do the do? bushings and do the shocks <laughs> all in one shebang this thing gonna be a-okay how much did we take off was it 14 millimeters i don't fucking remember <laughs> and then also i think you kind of like offset the uh the mounting point a little bit was that towards the inside of the car yeah does what just say frank have um slr yeah but he's not here right now find his car and measure from the ball joint to his power pickup. Okay. That's, Thank you, bye. That's option. You know what I mean? Say bye. <laughs> Alright folks, kind of mocking up our knuckles here. Got two washers under this to make up the space because we're going to have this be a little bit of a drop knuckle. And then you take out 14 millimeters out of this. Basically you're lining it up perfect with the edge of that. And then you can let this sit flush on the table and weld it up. Thumbs up. Wow, look at my shoe! <laughs> With those big ass BKs, it's tough to do. Yep, put my pants over top of the tongs this time. But that'll help. All right, look at that big one, bastard. Knuckles are done. Now we're doing extended control arm. So we're, we are in the process of extending these lower control arms. 
The plan is cut the good arms, cut a section, inch and a half, inch, inch and a half section out of the bad control arms, take it, put it in between, weld it, call it a day. All my custom cut stuff, look at that. Inch and a half extension on the control arms, 14 millimeters off of the knuckles. And come around to the other side. It's already, already all installed with the fresh BCs, you know? Because China. Look at that. Yeah. Killing it. With the reservoir. The reservoir and the help of spring, the help of spring and the stripped out tie rods, cause Justin stripped it. Check out the rear. Show the, show the rear coils. The rear, I already did that, but I'll show them again. Check it out, BC for life, you know what I'm saying? Thousand bucks. Junk in the trunk. When you need to adjust them, I already showed this too. For all you folks that ask about the red car, aka nobody, ain't nobody ask about nothing. Because deep down, no one ever cares. No one actually <laughs> gives a shit. About anything like this. Boop! It's okay though. We Smile. Care. Justin cares. Justin cares. Yeah. Look at that dick. Nice dick. I'm going to need you to do that again. <laughs> I got a lot done today. We got fucking the rear back together, everything up and running, except for the brake lines. We'll get that later. We got fucking rear suspension back up here. I got holes in the trunk so we could do this fancy dancy uh, reserve or uh, thingies that back there with the stuff, you know, your adjusters. Even though the suspension doesn't belong on this car, it should be on my car, but it's on this car anyway. Fuck off, whatever. You got the fucking front suspension on there, you got weld up control arm, you got weld up knuckles, everything's back together. Like, fucking A, dude. It's a lot of stuff. Oh shit, I accidentally took a picture. You gotta do it again. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> you got uh, black wings on your back. Where? And then you did the shifter, I forgot about that. The shifter's done, the thing shifts, just put all gears. It's still got fifth gear lean, true to the transmission being on fuck off. 200 buck transmission though. Can't beat that. This is an exciting thing. Check out the front alignment, dude. This thing's fucking, woo! Yeah, we're gonna need some inner tie rods because the uh, passenger side right now is straight. <laughs> Yep. Or you just try, you know, it's got a V8, so you just fucking push it. Push it real good. Do, 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 do. Anybody need some E46 control arms? For sale. 20 bucks. Come get it.